Oh, GLaDOS is being taken by a bird. GLaDOS, don't worry, love. I'll come find you. Well, at, at least try to. Ah, anyway, guys, I am Pixel, and welcome back to... Is this part 9 or part 10? It's one or the other of the Portal 2 Let's Play. Where we left off, we kind of stupidly gave Wheatley control of the whole facility. And Wheatley went a little bit power crazy and threw us down a big, big, long hole. And now we're somewhere at the bottom of the facility. And I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. And GLaDOS has just been taken away by a bird. And I'm assuming that if I want to know what on earth is going on, I'm going to need to find her. Wow. This is underground. How big was this place originally? Ah, oh, this makes no sense. Looks amazing though. So we fell for quite a while, so I'm guessing it's at least one, maybe two miles down. Underground. Wow, that's all I can say. That must have been expensive. Okay, so. I'm going to keep an eye out for secrets, but I doubt that I'm going to find them. Because I'm really bad at it, to be honest. Trying to figure out what I can actually uh, portal to as well is one thing. Okay. Um... Still got power down here. I wonder how long these light bulbs have been turned on for. Must have been a long, long time. Okay. Some of these structures, well, full-size cranes on the ground. Now that is crazy. Look how far away it goes as well. This place is huge. Have you guys ever watched a film called The Cube? Or Cube? If you haven't, I recommend that you actually go and just search it. Just search for The Cube, Cube Zero, Hypercube. They are really good films. And it, it this just kind of reminds me of that. I assume that we fall down here. GLaDOS! Can you hear me? GLaDOS! Oh, no idea. I'm checking for secrets. I know you're going to complain that I'm checking for secrets because, oh, it was so obvious that it was none there. Well, I don't find it obvious, actually. So, yes, I'm going to keep looking, I'm afraid. Like, the big keep out sign is obviously the right way to go. Like, keep out. We are, like, two miles underground. Who do you think is going to accidentally stumble across this? Okay, so I'm assuming that... Ah, it's up there. So when was this closed? Okay, so this was closed in 1961. Does that mean that there was no turrets back in 1961? Because the computer chip hadn't... Well, the computer chip had been invented, but not, like, detailed ones. So that means that we could be saying goodbye to turrets. Unless Wheatley has also managed to take over this part of the uh, facility, which I would have thought would have been blocked out, to be honest. And 1961, and whenever this game is set, we've had lots of speculation in the comments, but it's at least the year 2000, apparently. And these lights are still shining bright. They could have made Aperture Science a shed ton of money if they made these. So I can teleport down to there, but let's jump. Okay. 
There's obviously no secrets down here. This place just looks really crazy. Some more warnings. Okay. Do not enter, keep out. Wow, they really don't want me to be here. Like, really don't want me to be here. I hope this isn't neurotoxin either. That would be a shame. Hello, GLaDOS. Can't just teleport somewhere instead. Oh. Oh, wow, wow, that made me jump. That is a big door. Is this game gonna merge with Fallout? Is this like Vault 101? So. Ah, so it's got a timer. I reckon I'll have to press both of these at the same time. I reckon that's what it is. So if I do this. No. Um, okay, so that one works. But instead we are going to... So that means we got both of them, right? Okay. Easy, son. I want to see this. Wow. Please don't fall on me. Uh, is anybody else concerned by the fact it says keep out? I want to know what on earth they are hiding. And I don't want to find out by actually going in there. Do not enter sealed in 2050. Is this the reason that the Left 4 Dead virus got out? Like, is this what it is? This was sealed. This is back in like the year 2000s. And I go in here and it's like a zombie apocalypse strain free. Is that why they sealed it all off? And when I escape, am I the reason why Left 4 Dead and Left 4 Dead 2 happens? I, I'm trying to think of a decent reason to seal it off with this much security. It's got to be more than just dangerous, right? Right? I'm sure we'll find out. Well, I'm sure we won't because it's a Valve game. We never find out. Oh. That music. Do not lean on railing. Okay. This is definitely going to be some 1950s slash 60s inspired stuff. Just by the actual artwork on that. This is going to collapse. Don't collapse. Oh, that's collapsing. Ah, uh, so nervous. It's a different logo. Nineteen fifty-two. Is that when this place was sealed off? Maybe. Right, I'm not gonna jump off, I just want a better view. Anything around here? Anything standing out? So we're going to climb up that. That's like a long, long climb. Huh. Okay. I think... That I can get over there, can't I? 
Do you reckon if I actually fall at this angle? Oh no, invisible wall. And because it's an invisible wall, and that looks like a room with a door, I reckon that I go through this, but I said it's broken. And I must have to come back out here later. I came in on that side. Okay, makes sense. Yep, that must be what it is. What? Wow. Welcome, gentlemen, to Amateur Science. Astronauts, war heroes, Olympians, you're here because we want the best. And you are it. So, who is ready to make some science? I'm ready to make science. <laughs> now, you want to get one another on a little ride over, so let me introduce myself. I'm Cave Johnson. I own the place. That eager voice you heard is the lovely Carol, my assistant. Rest assured, she has transferred your honorary to the charitable organization of your choice. Isn't that right, Carol? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. <laughs> the of this facility, pretty as a postcard, too. Sorry, fellas, she's married to science. Okay, so, Caroline, there's a turret that said the answers were beneath, and I believe that we are beneath, and also mentioned her name was Caroline. What? Is Caroline GLaDOS? No, can't be, right? I'm just, I'm just thinking out loud, the backbone of the facility, like GLaDOS was, like when Caroline died or something, did they try and upload her consciousness to GLaDOS? Hmm. Very interesting. Okay, so. Get to the main lift and just go here, can I? Okay, so this has been closed. Welcome to the future of tomorrow, Aperture Science. Okay, so that must be the way. It has a big enter sign above it. And that would explain if we went that way, we could go back out through that section. I'm not seeing anything too secrety, should I say? Uh, you guys are going to leave it in the comments. I was looking at right at something and... Uh, uh, I get it. So if I go up there, jump into that... No, jump into that and fire myself over there. Okay, we've got this. We've got this, right? You know we got this. Easy, easy, easy. Kind of. Easy if you're not stupid. Okay, right. Um, so I can shoot this, right? So I want to shoot it like this, though. Don't I? No. Line it up. It'll do. It'll do. Now I want to try and jump and press this. Come on, come on, come on. There we go! Oh, through the aperture logo. That was almost perfect. That fell down just as we walked in here, really, wasn't it? Almost. Ah. Uh. Spheres. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these pre-recorded messages will cover any questions you might have huh. and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course of your science adventure. That sounds your cool. assignment will vary depending on the manner in which you have bent the world to your will. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today, just follow the blue line on the floor. <laughs> Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you. Fighting an army of mantis men. <laughs> the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. Oh, that's hilarious. So the injected mantis DNA created mantis men and now they need people to kill the mantis men. That is that is actually really quite funny. So 
propulsion gel followed a blue line. I'm assuming that we are going to be following a blue line. Right? Welcome, test subjects. Please sign in with the receptionist before proceeding to the lounge. Receptionist. Anybody here? No, no receptionist. This is so easy to say, and I know you're all going to criticize me, but it just reminds me of Bioshock, this area, for some reason. Cave Johnson, the douche. Best new science company in 1947, so as the war ended. Hmm, I wonder. That potato. National Potato Board for the promotion of potato science in 1955. Cave Johnson, shower curtain salesman, wow, aperture fixtures, wow, these guys did everything, local entrepreneur buys salt mine, ah, so that explains why we are so deep, because we're in a salt mine, I don't know how deep a salt mine goes, but, top 100 applied science companies in 1949, aperture science number two, because obviously Black Mesa is number one. Shower curtain salesman. Runner up because of Black Mesa. Runner up because of Black Mesa. You guys must really hate Black Mesa. And Black Mesa must be a really old, a really old company. Really, when you think about it. Okay. Onwards. That music just inspires awe. Jump! Don't fall! Okay. I won't lie, I'm a little bit nervous. What the? No way, right? No way, right? I'm not supposed to be up there, right? Okay, so... I need some white stuff. Oh, wow. Elevator control. No! It killed me! It killed me! The elevator killed me for some strange reason, and I have no idea why. I was stood on top of it and I just died instantly. Welcome to Bugs, guys. Valve is not the perfect company you first believe. Let's try this again. Ah, right, no, they're trying to stop me from doing this, aren't they? That's why there's no white walls for me to go into. Yeah, they are deliberately trying to stop me from doing this. So I should just go up here then. Or should I? Okay. He has no choice. We will raise... The roof. And hopefully get some answers to what on earth is going on. And I really hope that I find GLaDOS. GLaDOS could answer some questions for me right now. Or I will remove her potato power plant. So if I go to the one lower, I can jump down into it. And... Alright, so that's where I was firing. Dang it! Okay, so is there anything down there? No. So, if I go through there... Like this... We will see that there's actually nowhere to go, right? And we need to go over there, so... We're going to stick it on here. Well, no, we're not. We're gonna... Please don't tell me how to trap myself. Oh, no. There. Okay, so I'll go here. Kind of. Okay, so I wasn't right at the top, that was the problem. And I shoot that here. And I jump down the elevator shaft where I can, which is not at the top, because that's here. So I need to go down a level, jump down, and fly across. Like Superman! And I'm firing the blue portal today. 
Why? Why like a bird? I mean, wow. That looks like it's constructed really well because technically physics wouldn't allow that to happen. Power station alpha. So this is just one power station. You wouldn't name it alpha if you only had, if you only had one, you'd name it the power station. Oh, don't touch anything unfamiliar. Do not inhale fumes, no matter how good they smell. <laughs> Oh, jail pressure control. I'll press that. So I've done something. Not exactly sure what. Okay, so is this... Okay. Gel flow is going upwards. Doesn't seem to be anything down here, so I'm guessing that I have to get up somewhere and if I fall down I have to climb back up and that's my punishment. Cave Johnson is such a cool name though, by the way. I actually like it. Okay, so up there. Okay, um, look at that for a jump, like a seasoned vet, but that, no, I don't want to go through there yet, I'm just checking. No, nothing. Oh, I'm an idiot. Yep, I'm an idiot. Oh. I assume this is the right way. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand-holding. Huh. Well, science can tell you that this should not hold my weight if I jump on it, because it just shouldn't. Oh, is this another elevator? Right, so I've been here, done that, did this. Oh, we got quite a bit done today, guys. Um, I'm actually going to leave it at the end of the episode right now because going down here, I assume we're going to get introduced to some gel because the gel goes down here also. Then again, it could go up, I suppose. <gasps> yes, the testing spheres. So this is going to be one of the tests. And some of the tests have already fallen down, which doesn't fill me full of confidence, to be honest. But I'm sure we'll work something out. Anyway, guys, I am Pixel. Don't forget to slap that subscribe button for some more PC gaming goodness and to like this video if you like this video. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out. Bye-bye.